Thanks, Rain. It's going to start now. Good evening, everybody. Fantastic having you here on this Tuesday evening here in South Africa. And I am sure it is, well, daytime, morning, different places all over the world. So we are going to have a um, introductory uh, presentation this evening. So I hope there's lots of new people on here and I hope you enjoy it. And then afterwards we can have some Q&A. So what I am going to do is I am going to mute everybody and ask everybody not to try and um, unmute themselves, but I'm going to do it in the security setting so that there's no noise whilst we're busy presenting. And then I'm also going to close the chat whilst we're busy presenting. And then we can have some Q&A afterwards. Thank you very much. Okay, so whilst I'm talking, if you have any questions, maybe just note them down and then we can assist you with that afterwards. But hopefully I will actually have covered all the questions that you may have. So let me screen share. Um, here we go. Okay. We are going to listen to an awesome little video. While it's always nice to receive gifts, there's something truly special about the actual act of giving. Sharing your love and appreciation with someone special can fill your heart with warmth and truly bring a smile to their face. Abundance brings fulfillment and purpose to our lives while also uplifting those around us. How did you feel the last time you gave someone a gift? Have you ever dreamt of being financially free? Allowing you the freedom to explore the world, experience new cultures, creating unforgettable memories that you will cherish forever and ever. Spending the time to cultivate the connections with people in your life, especially those who mean the world to you. Having quality time with family and friends again. Instead of watching your life tick by at your 8 to 5 job, feeling lost and stressed in the daily grind, knowing how it feels to just go through the emotions without truly living. Well, trying something new can be exciting and invigorating. Imagine how it would feel to start living your life again, learning from others and developing new skills. Joining a global family of like-minded people can provide a sense of belonging and community and of course, foster a culture of learning and growth with a step-by-step -step method with support along the way. Let's come together so you and your team can achieve their goals and dreams of abundance. Do you have the determination and desire to live the lifestyle that you have always wanted? To create the happiness that we all deserve? Welcome to the Infinity Grid. Okay, there we go. Right, so what is the infinity grid? I think you guys might have just listened to that without sound, if I'm not mistaken. Anyway, the writing was there, and there was beautiful music playing, and we're going to move on to what is IG, and why is IG for you? IG is one of the most intricate, beautiful, wonderful platforms that you can be on because of what it can do for you and for your family. It is, is a revolutionary um, abundance platform. It's got so many different algorithms. It is decentralized. It's got logics. It's got rules. It's got all sorts of wonderful things that happen in the back end, which enable it to move so beautifully and to operate so beautifully it is truly truly such a blessing for everybody there are different strategies there's different grid movements and all of this is bringing people 
together to create abundance for everybody, to lift up all walks of life from all over the world. It is truly incredible. So please, everyone, be part of this change and share this activity with as many people as you can. We often talk about the, the minimum criteria you need. That's inviting some two people and um, just doing your first gift. But whilst we're going through this, I want you to think about the amount of people that you know, everybody from your butcher to the baker to your hairdresser to the friends that you chat to your daily, everybody on your um, contact list. Think about all of those people and think how many of those people would actually benefit and be blessed by being in this activity. So go into it with that um, mindset of how can you share this and, and uplift everybody. So welcome to our beautiful platform that was created for the people. And we're going to start with the grid. The invitations, your positions, and what you should expect. So someone that has invited you has either invited you to come and listen to tonight, or they might already have sent you a referral link. So you will be receiving a referral link from the person that's invited you. And you will need this to be able to participate. So when you have said to them, you know what, I am joining IG because I just think it's absolutely fantastic. Thank you for inviting me. You will go and you will click on that link. If the link does not open up on the website, then you must just copy and paste it into your browser. And it will open up on the registration page. And what you'll see there will be Honeycomb City or Infinity Grid. Now, Infinity Grid is already existing, and our new Honeycomb Plus, the $30 launched on Thursday last week. So it's been some exciting times. Right, now what is the difference between the two? Okay, on the Honeycomb Plus, which you enter for $30, this is a feeder grid into the main activity, okay? And it is a much smaller grid than the main activity. There are only seven positions, of which four are pollinators and two scouts and your one victor in the center. Okay. And these four pollinators will give gifts to the victor in the center and they will receive 30 times four, being $120 in gifts. And they will use that to move into Honeycomb 1. Now, you can choose to go straight into Honeycomb 1 without going through the feeder, and that is $100. And there you can see it's a much bigger grid. There's four pollinators on the left, four on the right, two scouts, two scouts, two guardians, and one victor in the center. And all those pollinators give their gifts to the victor in the center. Right. Now you're going to choose which one of the two, and then you are going to, where it says inviter, you're going to ensure that the person that invited you's name is there, right? Their username, and below that, their full name, because you want to make sure that you are joining the right person in the right team, okay? Then you will continue, and you will sign in, and you will see your grid. Now, that is your mobile view, and we're going to work on a laptop or a PC view, so it's a little bit bigger and easier to see. So you're going to click on your first $100 grid, and you are going to see this view. Okay, it looks like that. So you're going to enter your first honeycomb. Right there, it happens to be in the number one position. And what's going to happen from there? You are going to contact your victor. We do have, um, it, it's normally correct when you're giving a gift, is you contact the person that you are going to give it to. We do, however, encourage the victors 
to also reach out to the person that's doing the gifting for various reasons. One, it is it speeds things up a little bit. Very often the new person that's joined doesn't know exactly what to do and how to go about it. So we say, Victor, you've been around for a little while. Please kindly reach out to your pollinator, welcome them to your grid and ask them if you can be of assistance. And there you can get chatting in that way. So there's different ways of gifting. Most people use PayPal and WISE. Different countries have different options available. Um, then there's also crypto, but that is something that you discuss with your Victor and something that you guys agree on together. But it's very important, please, while we're here, is to remember when you're going to join IG, you need at least, a, other than normal bank, to, to somebody within your country or um, union or Western Union or one of those. But those take quite a few days. So people don't often like to do that. They like to use the ones that are immediate, which is PayPal, Wise, Revolut, uh, World Remit. There's quite a few. Okay, so please have those ready so that you are able to gift. And when you reach the victor, position that you are able to receive and uh, YouTube is full of training of how to use all of these different applications okay so you are then going to give your one hundred dollar unconditional gift to the victor okay this is somebody you may know it may be somebody you have no idea who they are but you are giving this gift to them with love no expectation back from them. So it is, that is why we say it is unconditional because they don't have to do anything. Actually, they do. You know what they do? They need to just click on your name and mark confirmed. But yes, it is giving a gift of love to somebody else to uplift their lives. And when you get to that position, the same thing will happen for you. Okay, so there's the give gift. And now we have all four pollinators coming in on that hemisphere. The grid then splits. Okay. And there it has now created two new grids. Moving to Scout. So you have now moved. And now is your turn to invite your two people. So you're going to send out your invitation link, which you receive, uh, which you can find uh, where it says copy or share your PIF referral link and your normal referral link. Now there is a, another PIF feature link, but we will go into them in more detail. All right. So if you're going to PIF someone, that means pay it forward, you're going to send them that link. And you're going to, uh, they're going to register. And then you will receive an email letting you know who the victor is on that grid. And you will gift forward for that person. If they are going to gift forward for themselves, then you will send the plain referral link, not a PIF link. Okay. And you're going to send this link to somebody that you know is going to do the same thing that you're doing, a like-minded person, somebody that wants to better their life, better their family's life, better their friend's life, or should I say uplift, whichever it is. Different people are in different um, positions in their life. Some people might be really financially challenged, and this can change their lives. Many people who are in Infinity Grid are already very, very comfortable, but they want to do things to help other people or they want to go on that extra holiday. So it, it ranges from huge abundance for all and an absolutely lifesaver for many. So it is the, the amount of different people and the different needs are huge. All righty. So we need a minimum of two people below us in order to be verified. And those are the people that you're going to journey with in your team for a long, long time. So it really does help to invite people that you care about. 
Right, so your pollinator is are, are all coming in and you are now going to move again into your guardian position and your two invitees will be behind you. There are occasions where things change or maybe somebody else is invited, but they should fall in behind you. Even if you're inviting now from a guardian position, for example, you can see this little guardian over here is blue which means that they only have one invitee at this point in time. Okay, there's different meanings and different colors. We'll go through that as well. Right, so now we're going to have our victor receive all of their gifts and the grid is going to split yet again and you are now going to be in the victor position and you are going to be blessed with your eight times $100 gifts which I must say right now, and please remember this right now, you need to keep $600 to be able to open up the entire infinity grid for yourself. Okay? You really, 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 really do not want to use that um, those gifts for anything else. You can use two of those gifts. But the other ones you really want to keep. Please make sure that your teams know that because a lot of people have not been properly educated and they have used of these gifts, which they should use to continue their journey. They've used them. So they're sitting a little bit stuck now and they need to get some extra funds, which unfortunately, well, they've already received it. But um, yes, let's move from there. Okay, so now you are going to receive all eight of your gifts. And this is a reminder. You're first a pollinator. Then you are a scout. Then you are a guardian. And you are a victor. So those are the four different positions that you will go through on four different grids in your grid one level. Okay. Now let's have a look. $100, you have those four positions. $400, grid two, you have those four positions. The same in the $1,500 and the $3,000. So there is a lot of movement, a lot of excitement, a lot of encouragement, and a lot of joy through all of these different positions. It really, really is exciting. And the more everybody works together in their teams, the more fun you will have and the more abundance you will receive and the more joy you can give to everybody. All right, so let's look at the journey through the honeycombs. So this is going to really excite you. So watch carefully. Right, we have honeycomb one. Now this little space where my mouse is moving is what we have been talking about all this time, grid one. Honeycomb one, grid one. H1, G1. You'll hear it referred to as that. And you've moved through the four phases and you have now reached the victor position. Okay. Now, the moment you reach that victor position, honeycomb two, grid one, is going to open up for you and you are going to be placed as a pollinator in honeycomb two grid one even though you have not yet received a gift okay so there are many people who want to gift out of their pocket to continue in honeycomb two sooner and they do that there are many people that want to use the gift that they received in Honeycomb 1 to gift over to the victor in Honeycomb 2. That is completely and utterly your choice. Okay? The victor can release you, remove you, is actually the word that's on there, where you would normally confirm someone when they've gifted. If you wish for them to remove you from that grid because you're not ready, you can tell them that. They might wish to remove you from that grid if you're not ready yet, especially if um, that hemisphere is, is full, okay? Because 
if there are four people there and they're not ready to gift, that means that nobody else can come in there and gift, which means it holds up that vector. So the vector is, um, exp you know, like, please remove someone so that somebody else can come in there and help you on your journey. Because this is the whole thing about IG, and it's one of the very special things about IG, is nobody needs to be um, what they refer to as stuck. I don't even like using the word. But um, so if you are removed, we've had a lot of people um, with the, the enhancements that we had last week. Um, a lot of people are saying, oh, but I've been deleted and I've been removed. There's nothing bad about that there's nothing wrong with that okay but it really needs to be done in a in a nice way so if your victor has reached out to you because you are a pollinator on their grid please have the courtesy to answer them and say thank you very much for contacting me but i am not ready if you will allow me to stay there that will be great if you want to remove me so that I don't cause any holdup for you, please feel free to do that. And I will click enter again when I have received my first gift. It's as simple and as easy as that. So there's nobody needs to feel offended or concerned or worried about anything like that at all. Okay. So now what the Achieve Your Early Access does, as I just mentioned, opens up Honeycomb 2. The moment you have gifted the victim Honeycomb 2, your 400 honeycomb one opens up for you as well. So there's your first gift to honeycomb two, Victor. Then your next four gifts go to honeycomb one, 400, Victor. And now you've got three more gifts. Okay. And you're going to put two of those in your pocket. And your last gift that you receive, you are going to give to the victor on your infinity loop. So your 100 grid, your first grid, the one that you can control in the sense of who you're going to bring in, how you've invited, how you're building your team. There's very, 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 very different strategies. Some people are just casually moving along. Other teams are building in a certain uh, style of how they're going to do their two by two or one by one or Many, many different ways to do it, okay? And everybody and each team can do it whichever way they please to do it. Now, you are going to go through all of these grids one by one by one by one and across and in. And finally, you're going to finish all your honeycombs, one and two, and you're going to be on your infinity loop honeycombs. And that is just absolutely amazing. And then... Now you're not going to gift up anymore. Now you're just going to gift back in. So on your first grid, you only got to put $200 in your pocket. Now you get to put $700 in your pocket. Seven gifts, seven gifts, seven gifts. Each time, and you've got two positions on each grid level. It's absolutely amazing. Right. Now, just a little bit more about Honeycomb Plus, the $30 that we spoke about a little bit earlier on. I've already gone through it in a lot of detail, so I won't go through too much detail again. We'll just watch your movement. Four gifts to the victor. Grid will split. Move to scout. Four gifts come in. You go to your victor. You're going to get your next four gifts. And once you've got them, you are now going to be placed behind your inviter on Honeycomb 1, Grid 1. And that is where you'll start your journey. So your primary position is now in the main activity of IG. And exactly what I've just explained to you prior to this, that is what's going to be your journey now from Honeycomb 1. So the victor from H plus gets placed behind their inviter. The inviter might not be in a scout position. They may have moved up to guardian. They may even be in a victor position by this point. So don't expect it to look exactly like that, but do just try and keep your 
pollinators behind you, everybody that you invite behind you. Sometimes there are some strategies on a grid where people like to jump positions. Those people that are not verified, you can actually jump over them if you bring your two invitees in. Um, and now with the um, shuffling and the sidelining of people who no longer wish to be in Infinity Grid or those that um, never logged in, life happens, you never know, they can jump into those positions. So this is what one of the things that really makes IG so different. It's basically sort of got a, a self-cleaning system. So there's always um, movement and, and those people will be placed on the sideline. They will never, ever, ever, ever lose their uh, position in IG and they can always come back in at any point in time, but they will come back in as a pollinator because obviously the victor on that grid needs to be able to receive their gifts. So um, it's just a nice thing to make sure that you don't get sidelined, okay? And there's so much time. People have got plenty of time and should have plenty of support from their teams in order to be able to um, get there too before that happens. Okay. Now, our total abundance is... Eight hundred dollars, three thousand two hundred, twelve thousand, twenty-four thousand, totaling forty thousand, of which only a hundred here, or thirty if you came in via Honeycomb Plus, has come out of your pocket that you gave to somebody else as a gift, and this is what you will receive. Now I say will, okay. You will receive this if you get to and you help there to get to and you build a team and you support them and you teach everybody below you to do exactly what I've just said you should do, okay? This is working like a bomb for many, many, many people. It is just incredible to see how people are being blessed. And so many people have been in these activities and they have been blessed like this because they have worked this. It is an activity. You can't join, bring two people, sit back and wait. It just really doesn't work like that. It's like you can't go to your job, do two hours of work and expect your boss not to fire you. You know, it requires input. The abundance is enormous. We need to put something in to get this out. Because on your other side, your honeycomb too that we've been speaking about is an absolute mirror image. And you don't have to bring in another two people to go there. This is a complete and utter bonus for the work that you have done in honeycomb one, grid one. Okay. And then that is 80,000 that you have received on your first cycle because these two run together. Now you've completed your first cycle and you're moving into your second cycle, which is your infinity loop, okay? And you've got a position from honeycomb one and a position from honeycomb two, and they are both in your grid one. Grid two, grid three, and grid four. And that totals $80,000. And none of that actually comes out of your pocket because you only ever gave your first 30 or 100. Any other gifts that you gift up are coming from gifts that you've received. And, you know, I just look at this again and I think, oh my word, this is like so incredible. It's just too good to be true, but it is true and it's happening. So know that this is doable. Right. B Nation. Okay, this is just something really fabulous and it's new and it's going to launch in a few weeks. I do not have the exact date or time. Uh, our beekeeper will let us know when that's happening. It is still in development. But this is something that you can join 
for $30. All you need to do is activate it. Okay. So the moment you have landed on Honeycomb 1, Grid 1, and you have gifted your vector, you will then go down to your control panel and you will swipe to the right. And there you will see B Nation. And you will click on B Nation. And you will land in one of those $30 grids that we were speaking about. It is a completely separate lineage, a completely different matrix that runs through the entire infinity grid starting on a honeycomb plus grids. And you will be a pollinator. You will all gift your victor. And this will repeat. And you will receive your gifts. And you will land on honeycomb one. But you will now be a little purple bee. Okay. So purple is bee nation, right? So anything pretty much purple that you see, it's bee nation. Okay. And this is sort of what the bee nation community power, right? Everybody in IG, thousands of people in IG are going to click the activate button when it launches. Now imagine basically an immediate good few thousand bees joining and pushing up all of our grids. They are going to go in this beautiful flow. Then they're going to go into our infinity loop and there's all this cross-pollination. Just want to touch on something else that came up today. Honeycomb 1 and Honeycomb 2. Honeycomb 1 follows Honeycomb 1. Honeycomb 2 follows Honeycomb 2. Okay. When you come into Honeycomb 1, Grid 1, you do your level best to make sure that your team is behind you. Next to you even, but behind you. Okay. So that you're all following. It's not the end of the world if somebody does split off because it is the program is programmed for everybody to follow each other. So once you would leave Honeycomb 1, you would go into Honeycomb 2 and you will follow your inviter or your, what we refer to as an adjusted ID, which is be the person that's just above you in your family tree so that your lineage and your family tree all move together. So it's not the end of the world. If you're not behind each other, all you've got to do is just invite. Invite and move. But try and keep everybody behind you. Okay, so just remember that. Now, this is what it's going to look like. B Nation, community power. The It does show two little bees, but there's actually three little bees behind three little bees. Okay, and we're going to have this absolute swarm. And forever and a day. Anybody that joins Infinity Grid is going to join B Nation. Okay. So it is a completely separate matrix running through Infinity Grid, pushing up everybody. And you, this is like a passive, a passive sit back and enjoy because this is all done by the system for you. Right. What's each IG apart? Many, many, many things, many of which I've already mentioned. And one which is really, really, really nice is the app. Okay. So you can download the app. It's presently available for Android. It will be available for iOS. We are looking at it going on to Google Play. It is available presently to download from the website. Okay. Where you are at the moment. And for those of you that are still going to join us, that is where you will find the link. You will download it. Oh, please remember, oh, and everybody, please make sure that you are on the IG official channel, okay? Anything and everything that's important with regards to IG is on the channel, okay? We will place the link again inside the chat of this uh, Zoom call 
for those that are not on there, please ask your uplines. Please be in that channel. There is also a chat. It does tend to be quite busy, but it's really good. And we love it when everybody comes there and tells us all the wonderful things that are happening because it is very, very motivating and really nice for everybody else to be able to share in your joy. Okay. Now, the app is per device. So you can have one app on your phone per your email address and per your phone number. Okay. Your actual um, device itself. Okay. And you've seen tonight the kind of abundance that you can have from having just one profile. And there's things that we haven't even told you yet, which I'm going to let you know now. You need to come and watch an advanced Zoom to hear all the extra things that we haven't even told you in this basic in introduction call. So please, guys, try and don't think of having multiple, multiple accounts. It's really, really, really ill-advised because you cannot grow and develop your team properly when you've got to see to lots and lots of different accounts, okay? Profiles. Okay. In the app, you get a training academy, shareable marketing that's still to come, dynamic page guide, a static tutorial. There are loads of different notifications. So when somebody lands on your grid, when you're going to get a gift, it gets all these little different noises and lets you know what's happening. So it's really, really, really exciting. Then something that many people don't know, and I really, really want you to please, 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 when you share this incredible platform with other people, please tell them the following. Okay, it's very, very important. IG is actually the humanitarian arm, a philanthropic arm, whichever you prefer to call it, of a third-party product. Okay, this product is due to be launched within a few months. We do not know exactly. We had hoped that it would be about, round about now-ish actually, but we have had so much fun with all the new things that the beekeeper has given us in IG, and he has been so busy with the developers, um, just enhancing and adding, it has just been phenomenal. It's really, he's, he's so passionate about this doing everything that we all wanted to do, okay? But now, the gift that you're giving somebody is actually a membership to this third party company. So every single person that has joined IG is already a member of this third party company, okay? So this third party company says, right, you're getting this membership and instead of giving it to us, please use it and give it to the Victor on your grid. And even more awesome, is that this third-party product is going to give you various means to be able to create a monthly income. Something steady. Something that you know is going to happen every month. So please remember this at all times. Please share this with everybody when you're sharing it so that they know IG has got so much more. It's about so much more. Okay? And then we have the third thing of our little trilogy, and that is a smart contract, a crypto contract that is going to be launched as well. Time and date, we do not know, but it's not going to be that long. So hopefully, hopefully, it'll all, no, I better not say. The beekeeper would kill me if I would say, I want to, I wish, I hope it all happens this year. But, um, we have got so much in IG to work with in the meantime, but know that that's happening, all right? So this pretty much um, completes the introductory to IG. But as I said, there are more ways to create abundance 
and momentum. So we would like you to join us within 